I want to talk to you today about how our Ontario criminal court system, both at the Ontario Court of Justice level and the Superior Court of Justice level, has been adapting to new technology and modernizing our court system. First of all, this is long overdue. We were living in our court system in the 19th and 20th century. And what COVID-19, the pandemic, has caused us is to say, look, we really need to get some virtual hearings, some virtual guilty pleas. All of this technology that we've never had, we need to bring in. And, and the courts are doing this. I mean, there's now opportunity to do electronic filing, electronic disclosure, um, designations electronically. And, and you know, the court right now wants to have as few people in the court buildings as possible. So first of all, um, from March until now, uh, we've been doing virtual guilty pleas. We've been doing virtual bail hearings. This is with the technology we have. So they've spent millions of dollars on this and, and it's, it's a great thing. It, it's, we, our system really needed to be modernized. We're even offering virtual trials right now, which is interesting. Um, July 6th, trials resumed in person on that date in a limited way. And in each courthouse, they renovated you know, one or two of the trial courts. And by the way, there's many trial courts in most courthouses, so it's, it's very limited. But we really need to keep taking advantage of this. Uh, I'm very open to this. Many criminal lawyers are. I mean, some of the old guard aren't. Uh, they like to return to the new ways. But, but the reality is, we were stuck in the 19th and 20th century. It needed to change. This is one of the positive outcomes of the COVID-19 pandemic. And you know, one of the many reasons for doing this, aside from it needed to be done, is we, we need to avoid a, a delay in the court system. And, and now you have an opportunity to still move your file. So I'm hoping the courts continue with this. They're very committed to it. I've been going to town hall meetings with the ministry, uh, attorney general and, and judges, et cetera. We've been discussing this. and. Most players are very open to this, and I'm, I'm very happy that the government has, has chosen this route, and I hope we continue it in the future.